Hi everyone, I'm just coming on to do this video of some cards I've been making. A few of them I made last year and then going into this year and stuff. Um, yeah, I just thought I'd come on and show you some cards then. All these cards here that I've made, I'm going to uh, donate um, to a local, well it's not a local, it's um, the centre that I go to. Um, what's a little bit away from me but yeah um it's a charity it helps bereaved parents and children if they've lost a baby or child and it's an excellent charity um the work they put in and everything it's just oh even just like me going there and the help i get and stuff it's just um yeah it's a lovely charity um i've done lots of um charity work for them in the past and then obviously when i do i do charity events and i do them in my daughter's memory um yeah um but these cards are just what i like to make and then i take them to the center and they put them in the center in a little basket and then people can buy them and then the money goes to the center um so it's another way of giving back really to them and stuff um so I just wanted to come on and show you some cards. The first one I made was um, this one and it's got the red flower stamp and that's just a little stamp I had. I think I got it free with a magazine. Um, I don't know, I can't remember like because this one um, I made last year. Um, but yeah if you can see it i'm trying to see if you can see it a lot so cause it's a bit dark even though it's light outside i've had to put my light on um because i'm not right near the window so there's not much light um so i've put my little lamp kind of thing at the side of my desk on but yeah it's got the ribbon down here and then it's got happy birthday up here and then it's got this glitter paper in the background that's a lot better um, yeah, so I just stamped loads of the flowers on there, and then inside this one, I put some white paper so it can be. That's where they can write. The next one I did was this one. It's got the same happy birthday up here with the purple glitter background. It's got this flower paper in the background, and it's got two of the flower stamps, and then that one's just plane inside. I just need to get them all with the envelopes and then put them in the little white uh, like see-through bags and then be able to take them with me tomorrow. This one is just for you. Um, they're from my twin cheese what I made last year. Um, this one and the next one I'll show you. These two I made last year. Um, but yeah, like I said, it's got just for you on, and then I've put these two butterflies on, and it's got this flower background. Um, I loved making these last year in the summer. The, the idea where I actually got to make them was off a swap, what I did. Um, and then I made loads for a swap, and then these ones I made on this one. Um, I made them, and I always, I just kept, like I had the idea I just wanted to be able to put it on a card so I put all four of them together made them different and then put happy and then the birthday on and I love this card but I am I'm gonna donate it Um, yeah it's just got all the different details to them and stuff Um, yeah I loved I think it was probably one of my best swaps I did Um, it was on a craft group um i think it was called make it mail it craft swap uh, uk i'll try and link their link below but the lovely lady i did the swap with she sent me some twinchies back um these ones they're like mixed media kind of ones but they're lovely they're just two by twos and um yeah she did a nice butterfly one there and then there I love butterflies. 
um, if you can see that so that was off her but yeah like I said I was um, on about this card with my twinches on and this one's just plain inside um, I just made one a card recently this this one is with a twinchy on that I made last year I think I've got a video of how I made these ones um, and another video of another one I made uh, like black and white twinchies but this one's just a plain one what I've got left and then this one I just put on there by itself and then put double sticky paper at the background and um, so it would stand out it's got two of the butterflies on and then I put my nice new black ribbon on and I like this paper so that's that one this one was made out of a temp I cut out a butterfly template and then drawn it on to this card and then I cut it out with my uh, hand cutter like cut round it and then um, I put like done the same with this glitter paper and stuck it on there and I just think that like the, it just looks lovely on there and then I pull it the glitter paper at the bottom here with and then the happy birthday on top that one's just a simple one so it's just like that when it stands up the next one is um this beautiful butterfly paper design on here and this was from uh, Dee from Black Cat Crafts um, she sent me loads of printed butterflies like this last year uh, for my birthday um, and I used this one on here I've still got loads of them left but I need to use them but I want to try and hoard them um, because I just love all the butterflies on there. I just love butterflies so much. Um, but yeah, I pull it on there and I put like a uh, background on it. And then this ribbon here. I just double crisscross the ribbon. And I just put happy birthday in and a pink border background. And again, that one's just plain inside. I think in this one I'm going to put some paper here so I can cover up these probably put like like the white piece inside so they can write on and then the last one is this one I made this one last year um, it says happy birthday like a ticket kind of here and then I've put I got a picture of this one on my uh, Olivia's Crafty Boutique um, page on Facebook uh, I pull it, I've done a picture last year and pull it on um, but yeah it's got the flowers doubled here and then I just put some little um, ribbon flowers and then on top I put some little pearls and then I put all the ribbon in the background here and then the what uh, the pink uh, border kind of here and then the paper's got a flower design and if you can see I thought that was really nice and then it just stands up like that um, but yeah these are all my cards that I made and I'm going to put them in there um, bags with the envelopes and then I'm going to take them with me tomorrow um, and then they'll be able to sell them um, yeah I just thought I'd come on and um, say about my cards and that I made and show you some and stuff um, well I'm well I'm on anyway I just want to say I've seen that I've been my subbies have been going up so I just want to take this time and say thank you to everyone who subbed to my channel and um, like I'm thankful for all my old subbies and all the new uh, like subbies what I've been getting. Um, so like if you want to watch any of my old videos, uh, like where I made the twinchies last year or something, just go ahead and watch that video and then make them and stuff if, it, if it'll help you. Um, yeah, so I just want to say thank you um, and it means so much um, 
that you're subbing to my channel and watching my videos and um, yeah and a lot of the ladies um, I've known with the crafting community and that um, they're all just like friends really because I've known them for quite a while now and everyone's just so lovely and um, supportive and then like uh, just like with that wish thing at the minute what's going on and everybody's giving out uh, like helping like granting someone's wish and so if you have wishes and um, like it's being granted and then you can grant someone else's um, but yeah I just love the crafting community so I just want to take this time and say thank you to everyone um, it means so much to me um, I love coming on to do my videos and that um, and I love seeing all the other videos what the ladies and gents and that are doing um, okay Thank you for watching this video and I'll speak to you all soon. Bye.